way between the two of them. But um, this is a, called a fan cycle from, um, oh gosh, I got the idea with Mallarmé. It looks like uh, fans are on the way out, although I saw one at DOS the other night and uh, at a rock uh, event, so maybe they're not totally going. So uh, Mallarmé would, had a habit of writing on fans for the women he loved. And um, those fans are preserved. And so I speak sometimes in the voice of Mallarmé and sometimes as lover. And I'll just read you this one poem. Orchestral sound, scintillating piano. Maria, did you leave me for a bright star? 16.8 light years away? Is the culprit Altair, that hot incandescent body, rapidly spinning in Aquila the Eagle constellation? Does your lover live in a mess of dust and gas, whimsically called the cloud of G, the G cloud? Does he touch you there? The fan, refreshing breeze assistant, stirs a gust of air, pushes her upward a foot or so off the ground. Typical state when confronted with adoration. The fanatic, that faithful attendant, dreams of favored status. She raises and lowers her fan, exposes one blue eye, one green, a cherry painted upper lip, plum painted full lips, tutti frutti lips, Archimboldo lips, lips of a thousand women on a tray. Would you like a glass of champagne to accompany your amuse, amuse bouche? Something that amuses your mouth like an appetizer. The fan is an implement of mass distraction. This we know. Flip the guards open, whip them close. Now you see me, now not. Plus the old microcosm of the accessory itself. When folding in this endless poker game, raise you one and double that. Careful you don't lose sight of the early 19th century woman hunter, dead bird in hand, rifle slung over a shoulder, boy and girl frolicking round a water pump like a maypole, yelping dogs at their feet or the enchanting 1905 Du Villeroy creation, French netting now torn, embroidered with feathery thistles in silver and cream. Tell me the story of just how that fan was ripped, and was your bedroom door open or closed? In Georgia, we have laws about that. When splayed, the tortoise shell struts like webbed feet are digits for all to see. Where are they marching tonight? She fidgets, runs a finger over the ribs of the monture, all the parts of the edifice that give the fan its structure. She unfurls her micro landscape. Tonight, a scene of bullfighting will unfurl. In the background, Women in mantillas, foreground, matador fanning his cape. Picadors on horseback lance the bull's shoulders, enraging the animal for the last time. Thank you. Thank you.